welcome to this video on using RefWorks for Anglia Ruskin staff and students. In this video, I'm just going to show you how to edit a record after you've imported it into RefWorks. Often, um, RefWorks will import things and some of the fields will be missing or you need to change details or you might want to add an attachment. So at the top here, I've got a record that I added earlier on in one of the previous videos. If I just click on that record, what that does is it brings up a little box at the side where you can edit it. So if the authors were wrong, if it was a book and it missed out the publisher, that kind of thing, you can go in and add those details. So if I just click on the little pencil here, I can see that I'm happy with the authors. I might want to copy and paste the abstract if it's not brought that up over with it. I might want to add a PDF attachment of the full article. Hasn't got issue numbers here, I might want to add those. And also you could add some notes. So you could have read the article and you could add notes about what it's good for, etc. Another feature is in some referencing styles, and especially Anglia Ruskin in Harvard, you can reference some of the references as print records, and you might want to do this for books as well. RefWorks assumes everything's electronic, so if you don't want to reference it as an electronic source, all you need to do is remove that tick just there, and it will take off the available through, etc. details. You've also got add more fields, so if something isn't there, you can add it. So we could add a date retrieved, we can add a place of publication, etc. Then all you do is press save. And now you can see it's taken out all the source details and the URL. We've still got issue missing, so I might need to go and see if there's any um, issue details for that journal article. 